Hello, this is Steve, Dichroic Glass Man on YouTube. What I'm showing here is a piece of paper. And it looks a little bit splotchy, I can understand that. But what I wanted to show you was, it's called a rubbing. You remember back in school when we'd stick a quarter underneath a piece of paper and rub it with a pencil? Well, what I wanted to say was, I copied this panel when digital cameras weren't real big. I might have had a digital camera, but I wasn't able to get it, or whatever. I might have sold the window, might have been, uh, oops, crud, I need to get a picture of that for my working drawing, you know, you know how that goes, you, you let a window go and you forget to get the picture, and the people don't have a camera and you seem to lose the pattern and the design. What I want to show you is that, if you think about it, you're capable of getting the design by doing a rubbing. Let me kind of reiterate, I'm going to set the camera down for a second and grab a panel. So, I've got a real panel here, a real stained glass panel. And what I want to say is, if you would take a piece of paper and just stick the piece of paper over the top of this stained glass panel and rub it with a pencil, you're going to see that you're going to be able to create a rubbing just like this. It's called a rubbing. So if there's ever a window you need to get mechanical drawing back again and see I can trace this back out on poster board carbon paper and what have you and, re and redo this pattern so all is not gone just because the panel left and you, no one had a camera at the moment just do a rubbing if you can get a hold of some paper and that's going to handle the situation in fact if you ever drive into a situation where there's a panel there and you love the corner or something and you have the opportunity to do a rubbing this is how you would do it. So, just kind of giving you a heads up, an idea of something that's always been available to us, but maybe you haven't thought about it yet. Just trying to present a new idea. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.